who would have thought when you first started on TV and you were this uh, brash young newcomer and it was exciting because you were, well, you know, you were new, you were fresh. Uh, but now it's a commonplace that men are in the kitchen. Yeah. And, you know, and it's, it's and well, partly I think it's down to you. Yeah, when I started, cooking was for girls. Yeah. Uh, and then a few years later, we managed to convince everyone that cooking got you girls. And that was the kind of turning point. Ah, yeah. And uh, men went from literally three years of hatred, like hardcore hatred. What, not liking you? Yeah, roughed up, chased the whole thing. Wow. And then literally oh, they started to... wonderful. When they started... <laughs> <laughs> Chase you too. Uh, up the street. Oh, Jeez. up the street. Yeah, <laughs> Come on, alleyways. Well, after his marriage, Piper's <laughs> chasing you. Yeah, they, they for genuinely... cooking on television. But, well, what happened? You got to remember, I was 23, and men and women were both going to work and doing the same hours. They get home, and men across the country go, "What's for dinner?" You know, it was mm. different. It was 17 years ago. Yeah, I'm old yeah. now. So I'm they 40. chased you. <laughs> they, were, they were really annoyed, but when they, they were they were threatened by him. That's what they you're were, saying. They were when threatened. When they started realising a little bit of information could get them a few more bunk ups. Yeah. <laughs> then uh, I then, like to think there's a bit more to it than that, though, because not there much, is a, not much. But there's a joy to cooking. I think most there men is. who become they actually say, hold on, there was there was nothing before. There were raw materials, and now there is this hopefully splendid feast that I have uh, created. Yeah, I think it's a beautiful thing. It's a life skill. That, that can not only give you pleasure, but it can give you more years on the planet.